Good morning, everybody. I'm Miss Best to be a blessing. Today is October the 28th. This is a reading for my kings and my queens, my lovely Leos. Before I get started, please take a moment to check that you are subscribed to my channel. It's something that's definitely going on with YouTube. So even if you are a subscriber of mine, just make sure that you are subscribed. Thank you, guys. Can you check that? Please like and subscribe and comment to my channels, okay? All right, y'all. So with that being said, let's get into your reading Leos for today. First card you have is the King of Swords. So they tell me that there's definitely an air sign here. That could be coming into your life or you could be dealing with them already. Hmm. I feel as though you've been working extremely hard on something. It's a very creative time for you and you're working some things out. As well as getting help from the spiritual room because I feel like a lot of you have been asking for help. Angels, guys, answers, and reaches and they're there to help you. When I first saw this, card right here the queen of swords um there was a in my spiritual eye i saw a cobra on this table so there's somebody who's definitely just like this their skin's increasing your face they don't mean you no good and they're cobra. they're definitely your enemy leo so i feel like there's a lot of people who are your enemies here i hope you um paying close attention to your intuition if you're feeling that you know getting an easiness around somebody not the way you're scared because leo's ain't fucking scared at all not that just that uneasy like mm -mm, something ain't right it's like an abrasive feeling or your stomach gets a little something something y'all know what i mean that, that's what i'm talking about but it's definitely somebody in your life that cover was hooded it out so this person is definitely ready to strike so be careful with that get ready all right okay keep it on so y'all have a lot of enemies i know the enemies that i saw for you guys you have a water sign a scorpio cancer of pisces is an enemy and you also have a um another fire sign whether it's a Sagittarius or a Aries but somebody's an enemy here okay um I didn't see Leo it wasn't another Leo I didn't get that okay let's keep it moving you guys um I feel like somebody feel left out in the cold with you here it's definitely some water signs. This water sign is very a Scorpio Cancer Pisces like I said the on the outside they look very good like they're family, um, family oriented and everything, and they might smile and, and look all cheese all up in your face and this and that. But they got a lot of things that's going on with them. You see, Queen of Chalices. This is a Scorpio, a Cancer, or a Pisces. My strong feeling is that it's a Scorpio that's feeling this type of way in regard to you, Leos. Hmm. Some, they're waiting for something here. This is the two of ones. They're waiting. Some of them could be trying to work some type of magic on you or something like that. So be careful about that, okay? Mm -hmm. They've been waiting and watching. They want to do something. Yep, they got a lot on their mind. Do you see the fire in the background? They're passionate about this, whatever it is. I don't know why they got to have so much hate for Leo's. Then there are some, there is a water sign of Scorpio because somebody who thinks about you all the time can get you out their mind. Somebody's lusting over you, Leos, as well, thinking about you, want to come to you and give you an offer, but they don't know what to do or how to come about in doing it. All right, Leos. So you are working hard. You're doing what you need to do. You're shining brightly. I do see emotional fulfillment and happiness coming coming in for you. And it's good. Look at that. Those of opportunity is opening up for you. Receiving a hand out. Hand up. I say hand up because hand out is like, oh, like you just need it. I'm, Leos don't need anything. You know what I'm saying? A hand up is somebody who's going to help you to get up. You understand the difference? All right, Leos. Um, there is... Um, you're going to receive a new lover's relationship in your life. And some of you have been wanting this for a very long time. It's going to be passionate just like you want. It's going to be the person that you ask the universe for. And they're coming in on the horizon. You just have to close some other doors in order for this to come in. Because um, new love can come into some mess that you're already in. Your next card, Leo, here is... See, I said you had to walk, walk away from some things. And this card is saying whatever you've been working on so extremely hard, this is different. Different than what this is. You're working extremely hard on something. It's time for you to walk away from some people, places, and things within your life. 
You've wanted to manifest something, but you're going to have to walk away. Be careful of temptation. You see this devil card? There's some of you could be eating too much, overindulging too much. And sweets. Sweets could be food, but sweets could be a person too. Hello. Don't get it fucked up and don't get it twisted. It is what it is. You're drinking too much. You know, you might like a drinky drink. A smoky smoke. Y'all know what I'm saying. Quit playing. Don't do it so much. <laughs> you could dabble, but not so much. Be careful of that. And somebody could be obsessing about you, too. But we already know that this water sign is over-obsessing about you. These, these fuckers got it going on up here. I don't know who this is, what it comes. But um, I'm telling y'all, Leos, be careful. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Also, it's definitely a Scorpio. But also, there's a uh, fire sign. Not a Leo. A Sagittarius. Or an Aries. That don't mean you no good. Remember what I said about the cobra being on the table. Alright. Um, so let's see you guys. Alright. So stability is definitely yours. Leos, because you work extremely hard in order to get so. Could be somebody wanting to steal something from you too. Universe is definitely blessing you. Your world is going to be changing. But changing for the better. I think that you see in the background. Some of y'all went through something, but you done came through it. You're shining bright as gold. Shit, you done went through that bullshit. Some Le Leos have definitely gone through a lot in their lives. So that's why, they, but they always get up. They keep going. No matter what somebody try to stop us, we keep going. It doesn't matter. You know, you could talk about us. You could try to put us down, whatever. But Leo's doing their damn thing. All right? I feel as though you're manifesting some great things in your life, and it's definitely you. Here's the Emperor card. The Emperor card is you're taking charge within your life, but this is an Aries card as well. But this is you taking charge in your life, writing your visions, making it plain, and you're happy in regard to this. I'm loving it. I love it, Leos. I love it. Keep it going to get to your stability. This is an Earth sign individual. Earth sign individual that's coming into your life. They could be there already. They're coming and they're going to want to work with you. They're going to help you on some kind of business level. All right? Hmm. High Priestess is here. She said, follow your intuition in regard to everything that takes place in your life. Get the High Priestess. She ain't playing. You see? High Priestess, she knows all. She sees all. She sees in different dimensions as well. Hello? Pay attention. It will never lead you astray. Empress, you're breaking out new exciting things, and things are going to work out. You also have here, mm, look at that. Somebody with a screwed up ass face. You have a lot of enemies. Yeah? Enemies. People doing fuck foul shit here. But look at that face. Look at that. Sorry, puss. The bitch even got a, the nerve to have her hand up. Now, see... I'm a Leo, and I can't stand for somebody to try to put the hand in my face. I don't get that often, but I've had it done before when I was in a store, and I lost it. I totally lost it. I don't like to come off my throne too much, but sometimes motherfuckers will put you there. They will definitely try to get you out of character, but try to stay on y'all throne, keep y'all crown on. But sometimes you got to come down. Y'all know what I'm about to say. Put a foot in the ass. Oh, that bitch got on my nerves that day, and that star was minding my own business, and that's how they do. That's what you, you see? You, you're minding your own business, you're shopping, you're doing what you need to do. I was shopping for my business at the time. This is my other business. I got more than one business, y'all. You know, Leo's, they not just one, not one business people. They have a lot of things going on at once. But I was shopping for the business, you know, doing what I had to do. And the bitch come and she reached right across my face. And I'm just like, I know you see me standing here. I didn't tell this, I told this before and she told me she didn't have to say excuse me and i'm saying bitch i'm gonna punch you in your face so it went on from there but hey she ran to the get the manager i don't give a fuck who you go get bitch don't ever as long as you living and breathing i was that's life from you ho but anyway let me get back to you irene because i be on a rant i be somewhere else thinking about back in that stone <laughs> my sister was trying to hold me back she couldn't she was sliding in the shoes y'all that was some funny shit but i had lost it when i go to that spot <laughs> bitch make me mad enough i lose it click click them just click up click up G bitch crazy but anyway y'all let's get back to my reading all right leo so anyway you're definitely going to get some clarity in regard to some things in your life and i also see mm -hmm, financial increases on the horizon look at you 
Yeah, truth and, truth and clarity. All right, Leos, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please take a moment to like, subscribe. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to figure out what's going on with YouTube. I'm trying to send them some messages or something. I think the bitches have no phone number, but they need to quit fucking around. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you, guys, and have a truly, truly blessed day. Thank you.